today we're going to be painting his head. Yep, so we, on our last video, if you guys saw, we we got done paper mache the eyes and the nose and the lips with looks some pretty foam. pretty good. Yeah, it looks pretty good. It turned out pretty good, huh? Mm -hmm. If you guys can see that. Tell us in the comments if you think we did it pretty good. I think it turned out all right. So it's all nice and hard, stiff now. So now we'll go ahead, we'll start painting. We've got our, our five colors here that we're gonna use for painting. Yep. The white, black, brown, red, and ivory. So that'll be what we use to paint the entire head with. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna paint the entire head except for the eyes and the lips. And then we gotta let it dry, and then we'll come back to the eyes and the lips. So we will start painting. Okay. So let's we'll start with this one with the big brush. Just squirt it out on our plate here. We have plenty of paint. All right, that should get us going for a while. All right. Now going to paint it and depending on your paint you might need to do a couple layers so just so you don't see all the newspaper writing and stuff underneath it but that's all right paint the cheeks and just paint the whole thing don't worry if you get it on the eyes or anything because you're just going to be painting them over again anyway. what follows is a brief construction montage Longer than a few minutes late. Okay, hey guys, we're back here. We got our mask. It's all um, pretty much dried up. Yep. For, month, for the first layer of paint. Now we're going to go ahead and do another layer of paint to make sure we don't see all the newspaper through it. So we'll get paint in here.
we got it all done. We got another coat on it. Yep. So now we'll let this dry and then we'll be right back and we will paint the lips and the eyes and do a couple coats on those and then it'll be ready to go. We'll be pretty much done. And, oh, and we'll have to do the eyebrows too. Huh? So we'll do the eyebrows and there's one little curly hair. And we'll, we'll be all set. So we'll see you guys in just a little bit after this is all dry. The next day. So on our last video yesterday, we, we painted the whole head except for the eyes and the, the mouth. So today it's all dry. We've got a couple coats on there, it looks good. So now we're gonna be painting the eyes and the mouth. So we're gonna start yep. with the white, get the eyes painted up. So, we'll go ahead and we'll get our white here. Yep. We'll use this here. Get a little bit of white, we won't need much because it's just the eyes we're doing. Okay. And we will just paint the whole things. You don't have to worry about the black circle in the middle yet because that'll be done after. We'll just paint it right over the white. Mm -hmm. You just want to get it nice, even around, so you don't get your white all over the skin. on this as well just so we don't see the, the black from the newspaper underneath but we'll do one coat and then we will go ahead and we'll, we'll paint a coat on the lips for the mouth with our red and then we'll by then I should be dry and we can do another coat on them. Mm -hmm. Alright. How's that look? Good. Does that look good? Mm -hmm. Alright. So, here is the baldy mask with oh. eyes painted. Does it look pretty good? Yep. We'll still do the, the black dots in the middle once the white dries. Now we're going to go ahead and we're going to we're gonna paint the red for the, the red lips, so we'll do that right now. So we'll go ahead and we'll get our red here. We'll screw it a little bit. Mm -hmm. Ones again, we won't need much because they don't take up much space. All right. Can I you wanna try a little? Yeah. Okay, go ahead and just paint a little bit right there on the front, it's like that. Be careful you don't get it on here, just right on the front, just a little bit. Right there. That's look, looks pretty good. The red covers are pretty good, huh? Mm -hmm. We might not need to do two coats on it. Need one more. Okay, let's see here. I want to be careful around these spots because. Might go on the side. Yeah, you don't want to get it on the skin because then we'll have to repaint the skin to touch it up. Mm -hmm. That'll just make it take longer. Yeah, we not need an hour later. We want to get this puppy down, huh?
color. Okay, we're done no. with that color. It's just that you can't look. All right, here's our, our baldy mask now. Yep, but he doesn't have a tongue. Yay. Yep. Starting to look a little more like him, huh? Yep. He's bald. What do you guys think? Is that looking like him at all? He's called Let's bald. Let's see if our if our eyes feel like they're dried he's up enough. He's called bald because he's actually is baldy. Yeah, so the white's pretty dry now. So there's a couple spots that are a little tacky still, but I think we can go ahead and do yeah, a little more white. Yeah, I figure out why they call him Baldy because he is actually bald. <laughs> yeah, that's why he's bald, guys. It's because he's bald. <laughs> that's why they call him Baldy. <laughs> it's funny. paint the red on the lips another layer yep. and then we'll do the black and, th and then we'll we'll paint some hair and some eyebrows so we'll be back in just a little bit see you guys in a minute later that same evening okay guys we're back, we're back. the lips are dried pretty good so mm -hmm. we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna touch them up a little bit more and just just make sure they're nice and, and bright and no newspaper coming through all right so we'll just do this real quick most of it looks pretty good. Then we might dry. So we'll just touch up a couple spots. We don't have to paint the whole things. touched up okay and the eyes are still just a little tacky so we're gonna wait a little longer before we paint the black on those oh. so we'll see you guys in just a few minutes Later. okay guys we're back yep. our eyes are all nice and dried and the lips so it's it's looking pretty good the last thing we have to do is to do the black in the mouth and on the eyes and then yep. we'll do the eyebrows and this hair that won't take a whole lot though, because there's not much hair to do. So, mm -hmm. so we're gonna go ahead. And we're gonna do the black it's first, like and do the eyes. good for the eyes. Looks pretty good, huh? Mm -hmm. You like that? Yeah. I'm happy with it. It's looking good. So now we will go to the mouth. And pretty much we're just going to fill in the inside of the mouth. Okay. And be careful with our lips so we don't 
get it all over the lips. Well, that's all to restart the whole mess. Yeah, if we get it all over the lips, then you just gotta touch up your lips again. There's our baldy mask. Baldy, baldy. Push the baldy. Keep thinking it's done, and then I keep remembering we gotta do the eyebrows and the hair. But the face, the rest of the face is all done. You guys can see that. We just need the hair. Let us know in the comments if you guys think that passes your inspection. If you think we did a pretty good job. We just need eyes and the, I mean the. Yep. Okay. So we're gonna take a break. We'll be right back, and we'll do the eyebrows and the hair. Five minutes later. Okay guys, we're back, and what we did here for the eyebrows and the hair, if you can see in there closely, we took a pen and we just kind of marked where we wanted to put our eyebrows, because once you paint it, you got to want to make sure you have it where you want it, otherwise you'll have to touch up a bunch of paint. So we yep. just drew lightly with a, a pen where we wanted to put them, and now we're going to go ahead and we're going to paint them with our brown colors we got here. Alright. Alright. So... I'll put a little bit of brown here. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do the brown. Yep. We're gonna paint the hair first. Right. It's a little bit darker brown on the hair than the eyebrows are. If you guys have ever noticed that. It's a little bit darker, so we're gonna do the, the brown on it first. Okay. And then we'll just add a touch of the, the creamy color to it, just to help lighten it up just a little bit for the eyebrows. Just to lighten it up just a little bit. Okay, that looks pretty good now. So now we will make our eyebrows. Basic mask. Baldy. Quarter. The quarter. Looks pretty good. I think it looks pretty accurate to what he looks like in the game. Winner. Is it? Yeah? Nice. It looks pretty good. How's that look? Good. Looks pretty good. Should I, you want to put it on? Let's see if it fits you. Look at me. Pretty big head for his little really head. Turn it out. Save it fits me here. Turn a look at me. It fits you. Does it look good? Yeah. Alright. You know what I realized while I had that on? 
There's still one more thing left to do. What? We gotta cut the holes so you can actually see out of the mask. Yeah. So we forgot to cut the holes, guys, but we'll wait until the paint's all dry, and then we'll cut our holes. That way we're not accidentally scuffing or smearing the paint that's wet, so. So we will see you guys here in a, just a little bit. More moments later. Okay guys, so we're back. We're gonna go ahead and cut the little slits under the eyes. And all you wanna do for this is just kinda estimate the space for your eyes. And you can cut them right at the very base of it, kinda right where the your your bags would be. Yeah. Um you know, right under your not under your eyes. So I kind of marked with the pen just here and here. And we're just gonna cut a small little slit. Yeah. You don't want to cut too much, so you want to make sure you have parents or an adult help you with this part. Um, okay. and you want to make sure you have a really nice sharp razor, uh, just so it's gonna cut it nice and clean. So we'll go ahead and we'll we'll cut You'll this cut here. Cut yourself if you don't have a parent helping you. Yeah, you may cut yourself, and that wouldn't be good. <laughs> Just enough you can see. Look at me. Yep. You might need it a little bit bigger. That's a little bit So we'll just widen it just a little bit. They're big enough you can see, but not really big enough that people can see your eyes through them. So I think it'll look real, work really good for what we're gonna use it for. You wanna try it on? Yeah. Let's see if Bentley can see. Can you see? Yeah. <laughs> so I guess it's a good size for adults and for kids. So okay, buddy, we'll go ahead and take that off. All right. And that is our video of how to make. A real life baldy basic mask. All right. Turned out really good, huh? Uh huh. So comment below if you guys think it turned out good, and if you guys were making one, let us know how yours turned out. Yeah. But yeah, this was a fun project. It was. We might have to make some more masks, do some more paper mache. Hello on some neighbor. Other, maybe hello neighbor one. So if you guys want to see a hello neighbor mask, let us know in the comments below. Maybe we'll do that one next. But yep, there's our mask, and you guys have a good night. See you guys all later. Bye. Make sure you subscribe and like this. Bye. Bye. We hope you enjoyed this brief construction montage. Oh, what a day. What a lovely day. <laughs>